So this is the space, very small, but big enough for me to get in and put a work top in and set the tools up and everything. Uh, but all this stuff <laughs> has to go somewhere else. Uh, bike at the back, that's my daughter, so she's going to be sat in that, so I'm going to get that out anyway. Uh, and the rest of the stuff, well, we'll see. <laughs> I'll work it out. I made a mess. But there's the space in there. Yeah, it's very small, but it's going to be big enough for me. I'm going to put a small worktop across here. Um, stick a light up. I can run power from the studio next door. And then I'll have some space to put some tools out and stuff so I can just grab things as I want them. Yeah. I've got these old pallets so I can make some shelving into a worktop out of these, I think. So I don't have to go and buy any timber, which is cool. Just need to figure out what to do with all that mess. Yeah. Voila! I've made a kind of a base, uh, like a frame for the worktop out of old reclaimed bits of wood, pallets, all that kind of thing. I've used an old mic stand as a leg there. And some leftover laminate floor that I had from when I did my studio build for the top. But I need to go to the hardware store now. Uh, I've run out of screws. All this has been made with reused uh, screws as well. I've run out of the right size screws now. So I need to go to the hardware store so I can screw this down. I might get some rubber mat or something to go on there. I need to get a light and some other bits and bobs. Easy. Screws. B and Q is expensive, man. So I'm gonna go to Wilco. I did get some goggles though. Gotta have some safety goggles. Safety first. There's my workbench. Come on in. Modelled by Graham Hutton's guitar, which I'm going to be using for a build. Perfect size for me to work on guitars. Nice. Workshop's all done. Yay! Didn't take very long. Much more organised. And I can get on with some work. Awesome. So under here you'll see I've got two tins to do. Uh, so that'll be a radio guitar and a camper van tin guitar. I've got a, a tin can ready to go as well to, to do. I've uh, got a couple of necks to use there. A couple of donor guitars. Down there, I've got this one as well, so I'm going to rape some parts off. Plus, I'm going to pick up a couple of cigar boxes tomorrow. Two. So watch this space. <laughs>